Hello, so from Trifold Production with another Blender quick tip. And this is going to be a really quick tip. And all this is is just showing you guys how you can properly uh, transfer your blend files from one computer to the next one and use an external hard drive. Now, what I mean by that is if you have a scene like I'm working on right now, this is a scene I'm using for an animation I'm working on at this point in time, and it has some different textures on the walls, the cabinets, and the scene and so forth. Let's go into cycles once so you can see what I'm uh, talking about. Click on cycles. We refer to process, and there it is. There's wood on the walls, tiling on those walls, the tiles on the floors, the sinks have a texture applied to them also. Now with this, if I were to just uh, click on save and tra and put it into an external hard drive and take it with me, I wouldn't see any of these textures at all. I would have to individu individually uh, pack those textures myself to a folder and export it with this. And even when I, if I, after I did that, I would have to reapply them again. But the easiest way to do that in Blender without having to go through that process is you go to File, External Data, then click on automatically pack into blend then go to file and then save that and then once that's been saved it's going to automatically apply those textures or keep those textures onto your model without you having to do it yourself so yeah that's today's blender quick tip and this is the fastest and easiest and most efficient way you can pack your blend files and textures at the same time into a folder so you can transport it into an external hard drive to work on any computer of your choosing. All right, thanks you guys once again for who have subscribed. I know you guys who will subscribe in the future. Appreciate it, and I will see you guys on the next one. All right, adios.